quick update on my uh, machining end of things. This here is a fixture plate that I use to hold down to hold down the um, scales as I'm machining them. As I'm, that way I can profile all the way around the outside. And uh, basically turns from that into that. But um, so fixture plate very important. Uh, these two holes are threaded, and what I did first, and these two holes, what I did first was I tapped the aluminum, and that lasted for about 20 or 30 pairs of handles, and then uh, tapped, and then the threads uh, stripped out. So of course it was the weekend, and the stores were closed, and an M4 nut isn't exactly common. So what I did is I made these little thingies out of steel, and I pressed those in. I figured steel would last a lot longer than aluminum, but I was wrong actually, because it lasted for about 10 or 20 sets, and these guys started to strip out. Luckily I made extras, so I could pop them in real quick. But uh, no, what you really need is a, some sort of a hardened stainless steel. So here's my new fixture plate. As you can see, pretty much identical. Um, you know, profile and all that. But on the back, I have... Um, used a tiny little end mill to machine these hexagon slots and I pressed in some stainless steel um, M4 M4 what? Um, M4 nuts so these should last a lot longer if not indefinitely and if they ever do uh, fail then I just pop them out from the backside and um, put new ones in I bought like a hundred of them so should be much better Anyway, I thought that was just what I was doing today, so I thought that'd be cool to show. Um, and this, anybody recognize that? No? No? Boom! Paramilitary 2 fixture plate. I haven't engraved the cool text that says what it is yet. But, um, yeah, which is... Big step closer to making these puppies. And I got, uh, got a whole whack of material ready to go. So that's next. Maybe tomorrow I can find some time to do that. But also tomorrow is, uh, you know, making these. And um, that'll do it. Thanks for watching. Bye.